Alrighty guys, so for this little uh, guide video for Sniper Elite 5, we're going to be jumping into the last mission, so lo uh, loose ends, there's no collectibles, however there are three achievements to be unlocked, um, two of which we can do um, in the first run, then we'll have to leave and then come back to it, and then we'll have to do the final one by itself. So the first two are to kill Mula or Mola, however you want to pronounce his name, with a headshot. And then the second one is to kill him from 600 meters away. So we can do those two um, together. And then the last one we're going to do in a separate run is kill him using a rifle with iron sights. So yes, yeah, so, um, so what you want to do is load up the game. You want to come to the, the loadout. Now, basically, when loading out, you can use whichever rifle you want, but the more power and control, the better. Um, for me personally, I use the um, M1903. I customized it. It's got the most power and the most control along with a 16x zoom. And trust me, hitting a shot from over 600 meters away, you're going to need this 16x zoom. Just my opinion. Use whatever you want. But um, but yeah, that's what I'm using. So yeah, so you can stick, it, uh, stick the difficulty in uh, easy or civilian. So very easy, obviously makes it easier. But um, yeah, so we'll jump into this. Now you will have to uh, skip some cutscenes and stuff. It's up to you if you want to watch them. Alrighty, so now when you first load in, grab your binoculars out and you'll notice that Mola comes from this door right here. Now, yeah, again, grab your binoculars out, tag him so you know exactly where he is. He's going to get in this car. And basically, he's going to keep driving and driving and driving and driving. And basically, you'll make the shot when he hits this curve around here. Yeah, so you do have to just be a little bit patient with this. It does take um, a minute or so for him to actually um, get <laughs> get that distance. Obviously, it's quite uh, quite far. He only spawns in at about 250 meters, I think. But yeah, so we're just going to keep following him so we know exactly where he is. Now remember, we're trying to hit two birds, one stone. So we're trying to get him with a headshot and two, oh, sorry, and over 600 meters away. So just keep this in mind. All right, so he's just about to go behind the building. Like I said, as soon as we see his car again, get out of the binoculars, save. Just in case you missed that shot, because uh, honestly, I pro I'll probably miss it. All right, so we're going to save. We're going to get our gun out. Because he is at, yep, 575, 600. Oh, no, I knocked his, I knocked his helmet off. I knocked his hat off. All right, let's try this again. All right, there we go. All right, I think we got him with this one. I kept, I keep shooting his bloody hat off. It's just a little bit too high. Alrighty, well, that's it. We took out both his eyes. We definitely got that headshot. Um, Yep, there we go. So, can't outrun a bullet and brains the operation. So, can't outrun a bullet, obviously, for killing him over 600 uh, meters away. And, um, brains the operation because you got him with a headshot. All right, so we'll quickly, quickly skip this, guys. And then we'll get back into um, the last mission. So, again, use whatever gun you're comfortable with. More power um, means you're bullet drop won't be as bad and the more control over your weapon is your weapon stability so again power and control that's what you want you don't really care about mobility or rate of fire at this point so again go into your customizations heavy bulk gives, it, gives us even more control all right cool all right let's do this and ghillie wrap is fine all right so honestly i didn't realize actually how good the car 90 ak was the control and power is almost full so i mean yeah definitely definitely give it a go so yeah, so we're going to load in. 
And uh, yeah, all we have to do is shoot him or kill him with iron sights. So again, we can probably do that straight off the bat. Because remember, he um, he comes straight out of that building. There he is. There you are. Oh, look at that. There we go. I think we just got it. Yo, boy. Yo, we got it. Ah, oh, we got two for one. Sorry, Baldy. All right, and there we go. We just unlocked the achievement sight beyond sight. There's plenty more. So there we go. From. Easy as that, guys. Look, honestly, you probably could have waited so, until he next? got in the car and got past well, the little Charlie fountain, because at that point, instead of being at 250 Paris meters away, he's only at 125, I believe. So it's up to you. But then again, it'll be a moving target. So for me, I would definitely just go yet. and shoot him straight away. But yeah. That's, uh, that's it for this little uh, achievement guide for the last mission. Hope you guys enjoyed. Like, comment, subscribe as always, and I'll see you guys Operation in the next Bracken one. Take it easy. Peace.